The last time I went for my checkup, my cute little baby decided to be sitting very comfortably. I'm only in week 31, so it's nothing to worry about yet. Most babies turn their own before their due date. We just have to give them time. However, I thought it would be useful to do a video about some techniques and movements that you can do to help a bridge baby turn. It is a series of positions that makes your belly expand or that simply take advantage of gravity to help your baby settle. If you are around week 34 and your doctor has confirmed that you have a bridge baby, this is what you have to do. As I was telling you, these exercises make your abdomen expand so that the baby can move and take advantage of gravity to help him or her get in position. So we will start in a quadruped stance, with the knees under the hips and the wrists under the shoulders. Inhaling, gently arch your back, allowing your abdomen to expand slightly towards the floor. Exhale and round the back, but don't compress the abdomen completely. Feel the movement that comes from the pubic bone and how it gently drops down while with a very soft exhale from the rib cage, you push your baby's head down little by little. Keep repeating this movement five to 10 times. Now make small circular movements with the hips, doing the same action as if you wanted to move your baby with your pelvis and the upper part of the abdomen or the diaphragm. Also do 5 to 10 times in each direction, drawing your attention to the breath, trying to relax and expand your abdomen each time you inhale. Change directions and keep doing the circles. All right, now we're going to use gravity. In the same position you are, Rest your forearms on the floor, leaving your hips up. Relax your chest towards the ground and allow the upper part of your abdomen to be slightly below your lower belly. You can also cross your forearms and let your head rest on them. And just relax in this position but try not to arch your back too much. If your knees bother you, you can also place a cushion underneath to support them. It is possible to deepen this angle by doing the dolphin pose. Support your hands again by slowly separating your forearms and lift your knees off the floor. Then walk your feet towards your elbows but not too much, just for a little bit. Hold for a couple of breathings and you can rest for a few moments to repeat again.
To finish, lie on your back very carefully. It is okay to stay on your back for a short period of time, even during the third trimester. So don't worry about that. With your feet resting close to your glutes, rise your hips, projecting your pelvis towards the ceiling. You don't have to go all the way up, just to the point where you feel comfortable and pain-free in your lower back. For this, you should squeeze your booty a little bit. In this position, you will do a small massage on your abdomen by turning your hands around as if you wanted to literally turn your baby. And at the same time, try to visualize how their little feet are turning towards the upper part of the abdomen as the head is turning down towards your pelvis. Keep doing this a couple more times, then rest and repeat once or twice with your eyes closed and always visualizing your baby. Alternatively, you can place a bolster or a cushion underneath your glutes and rest there. Then, just relax back down and very carefully sit up and continue through your day. You have the ability to communicate with your baby and make their birth as bearable and beautiful as possible. You made it! For these exercises to be effective, you must practice them daily at least once or even better twice a day if possible. So, come back to this video as many times as you need. Like it if you found it useful and let me know if it really helped you change your little one's position. Remember that to subscribe to my channel, you just have to press the button below and the little bell next to it, so you can receive notifications of new uploads. Thanks for letting me be your fitness coach. I'm Nena for real and I hope to see you soon.